So we got some ordinary people together to do a show about ordinary life to see what happens. We are we're at uh, Ordinary Life, an unremarkable series. Images of everyday life that we don't usually examine. So Carla started this whole thing on Instagram, hashtagging Ordinary Life. I don't know. <laughs> you just knew him. <laughs> No, actually, I don't know. I don't know how it started. It just started. It was in the middle of the night. I was going to get some milk out of my fridge, and I thought I would take a picture of it. And I decided I didn't really want milk, I just wanted a photo. That's how it started. Show people something different. Um, it interests me and um, it's just things I'd like to capture in a photo. My interpretation of ordinary life, um, focusing primarily on interpersonal relationships and a little bit on emotional dysfunction, and a lot on just, you know, being in different places at different times, and ultimately I think my work shows a narrative of going through one's formative early years, essentially, and it's unremarkable just because it's just got lots of images of really average things, um, but when they're made into this kind of different format, it becomes a different experience, and um, I guess it really isn't unremarkable, <laughs> I don't know, it's, it's making the unremarkable remarkable, essentially. I think we're all very, very sarcastic here, and our unremarkable series is just, you know, a way of conveying that we're going to be showing you things that you see every day, but you're going to be looking at them differently. I'm providing the music and the backdrop and uh, the essential soundscape to, to the whole ordeal. Uh, I'm bringing a sort of a, a mix of some uh, ambient, uh, trappy, uh, long soundscape, long uh, experimental. It's a mess. It's really a mess, but I think it. Uh, I think it works. Would you say your work is ordinary? Um, it's as, as ordinary as I know it to be. In my series, thoughts I have on long drives to work and back. I wanted to explore the way that I think about my bad habits, the way I obsess over them, the way I obsess about having to change them, 
um, especially when I'm forced to think, to forced into metacognition, which everybody is when you're driving long distances. And because I have to drive so many hours to uh, to work, to go to all these counties and, and provide miniature navigation, um, I thought that would be a good avenue uh, to explore those thoughts. I, I also think that roadsides are some of the most ordinary things. Cornfields, roadsides, those are all over ubiquitous. I've been put in a lot of situations in, in my working life and just in my life in general that most people do not face. Dealing with deportations and trafficking and human rights abuses. Hell, I'm shooting this video right now in Colombia. <laughs> my, my life is just not ordinary. But even though my life isn't ordinary, in I think in everybody's life, whether you're me or the most ordinary person in the world or the president of the United States, there are ordinary aspects of your lives. Uh, things that you do on a daily basis, your habits, the fact that you're going to die. And these, these are the things that I wanted to capture in my series. I'm a local artist who is a photographer who was part of uh, the art show Ordinary Life. And, uh, well, what ordinary life means to me is just my everyday life. I bike and I I, I walk and I, I go on the bus mostly, so mine's a little different than everyone else. Um, so I have a different perspective. I call it a view and from the ground. Uh, it, so it's most people fast paced um, cars and everything. You, you, know, you get there and get back really fast. I have to take my time. Uh, it, when I go to some place, it doesn't. It a lot of times it takes an hour or more just to get there, just to get across town. And um, so I have lots of time to bring my camera with me and to photograph moments from that. For this project, I also developed a lot of film. I had to send it in for an experiment, something new. You know, it's kind of like a uncharted space for me. I, I grew up around it when I was real young and then, you know, it kind of just faded away with digital. So I wanted to try something new and challenge myself and that was fun. Um, and I'm still doing it. I'm still trying to develop as a photographer. Um, thank you for listening to, to me and have a good day. Bye. What I was trying to do was mostly go on topics that I guess were things that jumped to my mind when you know the phrase ordinary life uh, is said. So I did things like coffee and driving and you know downtown and just other, other little events that just happen in my life and just kind of go for a mood or an aesthetic versus trying to actually say something specific. I went paper free and I displayed my photographs on this TV. So my piece uh, entitled Entropy was basically a photo slideshow and the photos were cropped very small the size of Instagram. So my piece uh, I wanted to focus on a lot of things that uh, dealt with my environment and the ecosystem and how I'm experiencing the world around me every day. So I'm always collecting pictures around town and I collect a lot while working a delivery job but just the effect that 
it has and the effects that I see and how much it's changing or in in the case that where I'm interested in my subjects is entropy uh, the decay of chaos and whatnot and I see that a lot in this town um, there's a lot of deforestation we burn coal I'm like driving around and even though that's hypocritical to my extent of the message in my piece um, it's ordinary life and everybody's doing it around me and they're not thinking twice about it and they're just doing it I just I copied Carla and and then she like did this show and as Steve said it was fun and we should do it again sometime this has been um, Ordinary Life and Unremarkable Series. Make sure to check out these amazing people and uh, check out channel The Dust Bunny for some animated amazingness. And yeah. This is my child. She's going to take over Rochester someday. Mwahahaha. Hashtag Ordinary Life. If you didn't come, you missed it. <laughs>